Episode 6, Motivation, by the Pilgrim People. As the weeks pass and the settlers grew accustomed to their new lives, John Smith starts to see a decline in the effort of the group. Pocahontas, you're moving a little slow on your harvest today. Yes, I just don't have the same energy as before. <laughs> my tasks are starting to seem repetitive, and it just slows my work ethic down, I guess. Hmm, it seems as though our colony needs a little motivation to push through these tough times. Now that winter is over, the first heat wave of spring is draining everyone of their en energy. John realizes if he doesn't react fast, then many of the goals won't be hit on time. John realizes that the best course of action in this situation is to use positive reinforcement to try to motivate the group. John understood that positive reinforcement is a desirable consequence that increases the likelihood of a behavior being repeated in the future. He communicated the idea with John Rolfe. To be able to properly reinforce his colony, I think of consequences that are equitable, efficient, available, not exclusive, visible, and reversible. John Smith and John Rolfe both look through the resources. John Smith, we have extra beer that hasn't been touched. <laughs> we must and we can use this for motivation of our colony. John Smith realizes that the beer was able to affect future performance in a positive way. There was plenty of it. It's visible to everyone in the tribe, and everyone in the group loved beer. So John, being the manly man he is, stepped up on his horse and rode through the town announcing the big town meeting. Everyone, there is a town meeting that will happen precisely in one hour. Be there and witness further instructions which will help us flourish our colony for the better. Nay! As everyone, including Pocahontas and the Powhatans, piled into the town square, John began to motivate the group. After giving an impromptu five-minute speech about pushing through adversity, John decided to reveal the new incentive program. Whoever's the top five hardest workers gets double the beer rations. Yeehaw! Ooh. Ah. Ooh. Yay! Once John announced this, everyone got back to work and worked double time. Because of John's motivational skill set, he was able to see production increase throughout the colony. Because of the leadership in Jamestown, it flourished as the first successful colony of the New World. Ho wah 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 ho w